Welcome to CrunchYourHealth.com. I want to thank everybody for visiting my website. Uh, thank you. Uh, but uh, I'd like you to sort of try to comment on the blogs themselves. Add a little bit like, uh, yes, I agree, or no, I don't agree. Let's, let's some, stir some controversy because that's what health is. Everybody's got their own way of doing stuff. And that's why a lot of people, I mean, that's why my website, just keep it simple. And you get it too detailed, you try to get too much out there, and everybody, they sort of all give up. So that's, uh, yeah, come on, on on my post and say, Dave, no, I don't think that's right. I think you're out in left field on this. No, I agree with it, but we can do this maybe because we're all learning in this. Let's keep this thing going. Today we're going to, 30% of everybody is, they're not eating a good breakfast or they're skipping it all together. So what I'm trying to show you today is a two minute breakfast. Two. So, and, and the reason it's two is it takes two minutes to throw your water in the microwave. We'll set the timer. So now we got two minutes to rush around and you don't guys, of course you're not going to have all this stuff, but uh, I use steel cut oats. It's quick and easy. It's not like heating the regular stuff. So right away it's a little bit uh, not quite as good uh, as the normal heating process. Here we got some quick uh, regular oats. Uh, the serving is a half a cup. I don't like to use a half a cup. I go to a third. And then I mix them together a little bit. So we're doing a little bit of mixing. I like to add a little bit. And what we're trying to do people is trying to take away the high amounts of sugar, sodium, saturated fat, and what have you on a breakfast. So we've got our oats, we got our steel cut oats. Now uh, another thing what I like to do is add uh, flaxseed. Flaxseed's another thing. Omega-3s, we're going to add some of that in there. Very easy. We got a minute to go. We got some psyllium seed. We're adding some more uh, fiber. Okay, and the things that we can do is uh, we can add uh, goji berries, there's some currant, there's some, uh, I chopped up some uh, uh, apricot, here's my sugar substitute, it's medul dates, so all this stuff I'm going to put into the water once it's heated. This is another one that I like to use, this is my, my uh, okara, this is my leftover stuff that I made for my milk my soy milk. Uh, you guys can go ahead and uh, put in uh, some real some stuff like uh, raspberries, we got uh, blackberries and blueberries. So basically what we're trying to do here is take away the process of junk like the, the overabundance of salt, the sugars, and we're trying to pack in uh, add in fiber. We're trying to put in some antioxidants through some of our our, uh, vet, our fruits. So let me get our get our water. Now this is two minutes. Now what we're going to do is take my okara. This is like soy, and what it's going to do is give me a little bit of a milky uh, taste to it. And some of this stuff here is like a dried goji berries. I'm going to put them in here to soak. Uh, we got some of my currants. Those need to soak. And you guys can put in any of your dried stuff. That, that takes the place instead of putting in any type of sugar. You don't want any type of white sugar, brown sugar, cinnamon sugar. Keep that stuff out. So we're going to stir this up a little bit. So now we're going to pour this stuff in here, and, and please, you don't have to put all this. This is a just a demonstration. I would normally never put all these types of things in here. You mix it up. Okay, now what we want to do is I have uh, hemp seeds. And, and that's what I mean on these blogs. Go ahead, feel free to Dave, don't put that in there. I had some lady thought that I was doing my own marijuana thing. No, this is, this is good uh, food. I got this, I think, offline. Um, so I add a little bit of that. 
I've been talking about chocolate. This is the the form that's the it's cocoa nibs. So I like to add a little bit of that. And of course, you're not going to have all this. I mean, by the time I get done with this, I'm going to have too much anyway. But I put that in and let let them soak in a little bit. Then uh, we got walnuts. Here's another thing. So we're we're not uh, only adding protein. We're adding uh, omega threes. We're trying to put in some antioxidants with some of these berries. Uh, we got some blackberries here. You, you can do blackberries today, maybe blueberries another day. I'm just showing you. And maybe you want to make it a tropical. You can get some mangoes or or uh, papayas. Uh, what's that other one? Pineapple. I mean, there's a lot of things you can do with this. But the thing is. Uh, I'm showing you a little bit more than you have to. And then here's some raw honey. I put raw honey in here. This isn't uh, nature's whatever, but but I'll show you. You can take it up like this. And we're just gonna drizzle a little bit. There isn't a whole lot, probably not even a t teaspoon. So you can work on this to make this two minutes. But like I says, you it's I mean, uh, thirty percent of us are not eating a good breakfast, or I mean I should say not a breakfast. Now a lot of people they're grabbing donuts, they're grabbing stuff from McDonald's, and, and that's that's not good. Because the two minutes that you could have, uh, that it takes you to go to McDonald's for the drive-in, or any of these things, you could have made this easy. And you can vary this so much, you don't have to have the, the same thing over and over and over. Uh, I worked at a local high school not too long ago, and kids were walking out with donuts. I said, what the heck are you serving donuts for? They just took away their soda and everything because of the high sugar content. So here all of a sudden they're serving donuts and here they say it's a grain. Well what grain are they, do they have in here? Because it, you got all excess sugar, you got salt, you got saturated fat, and, and a little bit of grain is, an unf is your unriched uh, white flour. So I mean stuff like that and it's the same way with, they have bagels with, uh, white bagels with a big chunk of sausage in the middle with, with cheese. So, I mean, there's ways of, of trying to get nutrition here versus just grabbing anything. You gotta put, this is your own body, you're trying to get stuff going, and uh, this is a good way to do it. This is a two minute one, you don't need everything. You can have one day, maybe you wanna put some blueberries. I always usually put flaxseed in, I always usually put hemp along with some walnuts. So one we're putting in a little bit of protein. You need a lot of fiber. You're trying to get some antioxidants and we're also adding a little bit of omegas at the same time. So I want to thank you. I'll talk to you later. Bye.